We're going to install our Jake shifter on a Yamaha. The first step is making sure that the shifter lever is in the forward position and then using a straight head screwdriver, snap off the clip that is holding the shifter lever to the car, remove the lever and the washer, save the clip for reinstallation. The shifter comes from us assembled. You want to disassemble the shifter, take off the top plate and the outer box. And the next step is to hold the shifter mounting plate centered on the shaft as shown. And you want to mark the inside holes on the top and bottom of the passenger side and the outside holes on the top and bottom of the driver's side. Using a 5 16 inch drill bit, drill the four markings that you just placed on the body. One of your holes is going to go through the black plate and the shifter lever plate. The other three holes are only going to go through the black plate. Now we're going to mount the shifter plate to the car using the quarter by inch and a quarter bolts for the top holes and the quarter by one inch bolts for the bottom holes and supplied lock nuts. We want to mount the shifter to the body and the holes you drilled through the stock shifter lever. Securely tighten. The next step is to unbolt the shifter lever from the shifter mechanism and install the stock clip. Once this is installed you want to slide it onto the stock shaft in the 11 o'clock position as shown. The next step is to simply reattach the heim end to the shifter lever using the bolt that you took out and securely tighten. Now if you need to adjust your shifter. All you do is take the bolt back out and you can back off the washer and you can move this up or down the shaft to give it more throw. The next step is to reinstall the shifter housing using the stock screws that you took out to take them apart. Securely tighten. Taking the stock top shifter plate, you gotta have the knob off the shifter Slide the shifter plate cover into place and securely tighten with the supplied screws. The final step is to install the knob back on the shifter and you're done. You see you shift forward, backward and if you need to make the adjustment you just take the top off, back off the bolt and adjust your high end.